Hi y'all, it's Jay from the Games Hotline. We've just put out this ultimate guide to dealing with hate raids, so I'm gonna give a quick overview of it in this video. We collected a whole bunch of community-created resources, direct experiential knowledge, and more into one comprehensive guide. We've got security tips, stream setups to reduce harm, chat and mod actions, and things you can do for community and mental health care. So yeah, let's dive in. It starts with all the things you can do in preparation, right? This is the bulk of the resource and just goes into really fine detail all the steps you can take to effectively negate a lot of what hate raiders are trying to do to your channel during a raid. And if you don't have time to read all that, <laughs> we do have this TLDR of three things. If you only have the capacity to do three things, here's what we think you should remember or try to set up if you can. You can also just skip right ahead to the section what to do during a hate raid. This gives you a checklist. You can print it or write it out, uh, save it so that you don't have to remember or recall it in the moment. Uh, we have two versions, one for if you didn't set anything up in particular ahead of time and one if you've done a lot of the prep work that we've described above. Uh, just have these on hand, follow them. And again, yeah, it should negate a lot of like what people are trying to do and use to, to hurt you during that hate raid. Of course, finally then, like any harassment, it's not just about the moment or actual actions of the hate raid, right? This type of harassment really spills over and messes with your channel and can also just stick with you emotionally. So in this last section after a hate raid, we go over all the ways you can clean up your follower lists check in with uh, your streamer friends who might be next, uh, as well as nourishing your mental health and community care during this experience. We know that harassment, you know, a big goal of it is to, to make you feel like everyone hates you and no one, no one wants you, no one likes you. And the way that we fight against that is always to, to connect, to um, reclaim our voice as an agency and, and remind ourselves in any way we can that we're part of something bigger. So yeah, it's a long guide, but we hope it helps streamers feel safer. Please share this wherever you can, and we'll keep posting highlights from it on social media. You can follow us anywhere at Games Hotline. Thanks so much.